Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3 and Super Jeez. Mario and the Cheaters of Death. Boots? We are still in the Druid Grove. Show me again? Not now. We're and working. I guess Remember? we will be here a little while Come longer. On. Hold out your hand, mister. Let me show you something. Oh, magic. Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. Call it. Heads or tails. Ah. Tails. Totally tails. Tails it is! See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheat, too. Interested? Um... I don't think that a single coin throw proves anything. Okay, fair. Let's go again. Heads or tails? Call it. Hmm. Tails. Tails! What the there. fuck? Happy? I'll take back the ring, but let me see your wares. You got it. One sec. That's what I got. Dang. Okay. Man, you are expensive. Nothing caught your eye. You suddenly feel something moving against your back and turn. Ah, uh, calm down. I'm not mad. I mean, you didn't even manage to steal anything. I can't do this anymore, Mattis. I'm sorry. Please, let us through. It is... Let my daughter go right now! She's a thief, Hellspawn. And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Mragrashev, or I'll rip your damn throat out! stood here watching, I was wondering what was going on. Do all the damn rituals you want! Damn it! We could have taken... Mm. Come, Magrin. Give him a chance. You, get back! Without me, the goblins would have overrun you by now. Take back! Force my hand and I'll show you its claws! A moment, Giona. What? Oh. I understand. You! Apparently Korga wants to see you. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Of course she wants. Who doesn't want to see Super Mario? But... Is someone singing? It's beautiful. I should ask LDG to add um, Mario jumping sounds here. Mm -hmm. But then again, it would take way longer to get to the videos. 
And I would have to wait for the episode. By the way, if you can't jump as far as me, you also can just hop the small ones. That will work as well to get over there. of the water is too dangerous. Don't you hear it? It's so peaceful. I hear no nothing. Get back. No, no. It's just a bit of water. I only want to listen. Just a little closer. You only want to listen, but you don't listen. What the fuck? Everything's gonna be fine once I get there. And now we will show those harpies what they get for being naked in front of a kid. Fucking points of damage. Gale, that's exactly why I don't like you. Yep, everything is fine. No. Yes. I mean, I don't know. Take a deep breath. You are safe now. Th that's what the voice said. <clears throat> I almost got to the nest, but the singing. I need to get back. Mole will be so mad. <sighs> Wait, um, you should meet Mole. She'll be grateful you helped me. Find a boy called Donnie. Tell him you want to see the dragon's lair. That scamp reminds me of myself when I was a nipper. Always getting into trouble.
<laughs> you met with a lot of harpies, huh? And worse. <clears throat> One time, my parents denied me a kitten, so I summoned myself a tressim. Ah, dear old Tara. Beautiful creature. Benefits of a wizard's education, you see. Of course, my considerable talent didn't hurt either. Well, that depends on who you ask, I suppose. I may have summoned things rather more exotic than a winged cat. For example? There was that magma method once. Nice fellow, we kept in touch. Of course, in walked the housekeeper, screaming, yelling, panic, and before you know it, fire everywhere. Anyway, I'm glad we got that boy out of his predicament. Poor lad would have been harpy feed if it wasn't for us. Swift as my feet can carry me. And who would have wanted that? Let's see what those harpies were hoarding. As I said, I'm not going to read this because translating that back to English would mess up more than it would good, do good. Especially with uh, the differences in the language between <coughs> English and German. I say most of the stuff uh, in here is taken pretty much uh, so it is okay for kids. Mm. Funny thing though, they didn't take out the blood, which usually would happen. Or the sex, for that matter. What the hell? They still have another level. <clears throat> hmm. How does everyone else but the main character get so many levels? Talking I'll be about... keeping an eye on you. Understand? If I choose to kill you, you will not even see it. You have to love those two, don't you? Stay calm, what's going on? Can't you hear it? Her singing. It's awful. Terrible. Oh. Don't make fun of her. She is giving her best, I think. Oh no. Whatever shall we do? More witless creatures. 
More ear bleed. My head is melting. I'm leaving before the damage is permanent. When you call the last light, dance upon the stars tonight. Smile and pain will fade away. Words of mine will change. No. Become. Ugh. Yeah, she really has a pretty high pitched voice that can actually hurt in your ears. <laughs> What should I say? This sounded a little bit undone. It sounded like a cat being strangled. God damn it! Yeah, the animals thought the uh, same, that's why they ran. I thought they were cheering me on. <laughs> uh, even animals think I'm terrible. I want to finish this song, but I can't. Nothing fits, you know? Let's see, probably I can help. Hmm. It can't hurt. I have her. I have an extra loot, if you want. Uh, sure. My teacher, Lihala. She loved dancing. Her two left feet mind. I remember waking up one night on the road and seeing her dancing beneath the stars. A huge smile on her face. Thinking of it now, my heart hurts. And my words just seem to crumble like ash. Wait. Words of mine will turn to ash. That's perfect. Words of mine will turn to ash when you call the last light down. Yes! Yes! What? I don't get a loot now? Damn. I should learn to shut up when I should shut up.
I'm sorry. It's okay, just cry a little bit. <clears throat> She'd have said the same thing. That's the first time I've played since Lihala died. My teacher. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. I, I can still smell it. Well, let's be honest here. If you are outside of uh, any, um, let's say, any village or anything like that, you probably do not want to play the lute so loud that you can't hear anything crawling up on you. But, well, your teacher would probably be proud of you to see you like that. <laughs> She'd yell at me for that clunky verse and make me play till my fingers were raw. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Finish the Weeping Dawn for her. I have a long way to go. But thank you. Uh, I needed this. Well, I guess I'm not getting the loot. Bang. Okay. Oh. I always forget that he doesn't do, do this automatically. Guns upon the stars tonight. Smile and pain <clears throat> will fade away. Words of mine will turn to ash when you call oh. the last light down. Moon, sun, oh, remind me of your grace. Pick this up and you'll have blood on your hands. I smell drama amongst these adventurers. What have you heard? <laughs> Just a moment. This man is recording my story. I am far from home. As the colorful man starts scribbling, the bear sneaks a quick look at the page. His brow furrows. Incomprehensible squiggles surround a crude sketch. A bear disemboweling a clutch of tieflings. Yeah. Ah, my good friend. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Okay, if you have to ask. Glory. Now then, how would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities? You search your mind successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Well, then I'll give him an exact detailed... Uh... Goblins were of a rare jam-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. A mythweaver. This man has no respect for truth. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? Uh, dragon. Let's think. I think it was the brass... brass dragon, if I remember right. Witness mistook obvious silver dragon for brass. What? Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the Absolute when they fell upon the gates? Yep, they totally was calling a name like a battle cry. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one. A captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Oh, come on. 
goblins and their beliefs. It's not even worth the paper, nor writing it down. Ah, but is superstition all? These goblins are informed by a kind of strategy anathema to their kind. I, for one, intend to get to the bottom of it. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, in fact. If you'll excuse me, I ought not to dawdle. Just be careful. Goblins are not very well known for their mercy. Ooh. Never you mind. Who needs mercy when you've a quick tongue, hmm? And an invisibility potion stashed in your back pocket. Until we meet again. These things over. Would that we could speak freely, my Ursine friend. Alas, Defende no sab, immenentibus, and And getting dark. Concentrating. Does this look good? Is the coin in the middle? Ah, uh, not really. I think you have to put it a little bit more to the right. Yes. Yes, you're right. That's it. did you tell the bird? The bird knows. She needs to know. You do not. Hmm. Well, I've helped to defend uh, the grove. I'm not your enemy. Because it is a me, a Super Mario. I... Forgive me. It is not you I fear. It is my brethren. More follow Korga every day. They are afraid, and she offers a simple solution. Eject the refugees, and we will be safe. Is she wrong? Perhaps not. But that does not make it right. Only Master Hulsin can stop this. I pray my bird returns with news of him. If not, I fear for my people. Huh. What happened to Hawthorne? He left with the adventurers. They went treasure hunting in an old temple near here. Master Halsin did not chase treasure. I do not know what he was chasing. But he never returned. And doesn't the ritual protect the, ha uh, the grove? Don't you help the others? With, uh... Everything going on here? The ritual is Korka's decision. <clears throat> but she is not our leader. Master Halsin welcomes the refugees in. I wait for him to resolve this. Okay. If he comes back. I mean, after all, we know Halsin is uh, trapped with the goblins. And I will call it here, and I will see you in the next episode, hopefully. So, till then, bye-bye.